Hi friends and new friends. Today we're going to be going over an interview I just saw with Tonevase and Kim.com. Now if you don't know who Kim.com is, he's an internet entrepreneur and he's uh, the gentleman who was responsible for Mega Upload, for in its day was one of the biggest uh, upload, uploading of files and file sharing companies on the internet. So this got him into a lot of hot water, but this gentleman is always on the forefront of internet technology, so it's no surprise that he would be interested in cryptocurrency and the potential it would bring to uh, retail and online shopping and everything else, uh, any ventures that he would happen to come up with. And uh, crypto would make an excellent partnership in these ventures. But they were talking about Bitcoin Cash, much to the chagrin of Tone Vase, and, but I, I'm going to surmise in this video that Dash would make much more of an interesting uh, partnership for Kim.com and his ventures. I'm Christopher Carruthers, also known as Tao of Satoshi, and you're watching Cash Alternative TV. So what is Cash Alternative TV other than that catchy jingle? Well, it's a show about digital currency with a focus on Dash, which aims to be a digital cash for the world, an alternative to cash. So if that's something that interests you, you want to learn more about Dash or just want to hang out with me some more, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell so you don't miss an episode. Now on to the topic of today's show. So this is an interview with Kim.com that I saw with Tone Vase, who has a much improved hairstyle by the way now. It's all shaved down to the wood, it looks pretty good. If you're watching this Tone, it looks a lot better than that bowl cut. Good job. And in this video, Kim makes a lot of excellent points of what he feels is beneficial in a cryptocurrency. And although the focus of this talk was on Bitcoin Cash, I think that Dash would offer a much better solution for Kim.com's ventures. And I'll explain why in this video. We're going to go through all the highlights of what Kim said, and I'm going to offer you my thoughts and comments along the way. Let's do it. So in this video, Kim is sharing a viewpoint that seems to mirror what Dash is trying to accomplish in the crypto industry. We're going to start this video with Kim's comments about how Bitcoin Cash is much further ahead when it comes to innovation. Shared with me some of, uh, some of the innovations that he's working on. And I think the guy at the moment, in terms of his thinking and where he is with his innovation is a step ahead. So as we all know, Dash is a leader in innovation in the cryptocurrency space with chain locks and instant send and uh, the, the Dash treasury. Uh, Dash is a leader in internet technology. But unfortunately, there's a media blockout out there that only seems to be interested in Bitcoin or Bitcoin type things like Litecoin or Bitcoin Cash. Dash doesn't often get its due, and that's one of the reasons why I started this channel, because I want to broadcast all the technology and all the improvements that Dash has made on cryptocurrency. They're, building, they're really building a perfect currency, and, it's, and it's, it's hard for me to see that happening and have it not be shared with the rest of you guys, so that's why I have this channel. So Kim, if you think that Bitcoin Cash is far ahead when it comes to innovation, you should really check out Dash. If uh, instant transactions and uh, low fees are beneficial to you, Dash has uh, chain locks and it also has instant transactions, uh, instantly respendable transactions, in fact. And we also have chain locks, which offers security against chain reorganizations, as we've seen recently with Bitcoin Gold. And we also have a treasury that can help you if you want to have a startup uh, capital to start any venture you want to on Dash. And the biggest one is Dash Platform that's coming out and you can create apps on it, decentralized applications on a decentralized API. So if you think that Bitcoin Cash is ahead on innovations, Maybe you should check out Dash. So Kim has a viewpoint here, which I share, is that it doesn't matter who comes up with the innovations. It doesn't matter about the tribalism that's in this space. It only matters what that innovation is and what it can bring to the end user. And I feel it would be stupid to ignore someone like that if it uh, helps to use whatever he creates to make the entire space better. I couldn't agree more with that statement, but it's something that you should know, Kim, if you're trying to uh, start a venture, something that you don't obviously probably know already, is that scaling is very important. It's okay to have a solution that works in a, in a small scale, but for your kind of ventures and what you're trying to do, you want to scale up to billions and billions of transactions. And that's something that Dash is capable of doing. We had a recent stress test where we were capable of handling 3.5 million transactions on the blockchain. And this is something that is a record, a current record in cryptocurrency that hasn't been beaten to this day. And we still had space available after that. And that's with present technology. With the in innovations and the advancements that Dash is making, we could really make a big dent in this uh, transaction race. And that's where you know I want to come in as uh, a bit of a game changer because I know already that what I'm creating now is going to be used by hundreds of millions of people. I have no doubt about it. I've done it before. I've built super large 
sites, you know, about a billion people in the world have touched my numerous different websites that I've built. So all of my knowledge that I've gathered over the last decade is now in this product. And I know what users want. So I've created something that I think could be a killer app for crypto. So Dash would be more than ready to scale and be an excellent partner in your cryptocurrency ventures. So we learn here that Kim.com is not a big fan of the tribalism in the cryptocurrency space. He's focusing on another aspect. And then I'm looking at the reality of crypto today, all this fighting, real innovation, not uh, uh, being recognized because of this fighting, because of the toxicity. So what I would like to do, if I get to a, a point of influence, because we are bringing so many users into the space, I want to make sure that we look at innovation again. You know, that we look at what are the best ideas. And if you believe it or not, Roger has some really good ideas. He's working on cool stuff in terms of security, privacy, uh, you know, and I also agree with his argument that in order to be a very successful cryptocurrency, you need to provide fast uh, and cheap transactions. So let me reiterate again, when it comes to being a day-to-day -day digital cash, there is no other network out there right now that can compete with Dash. Let me explain why. First of all is Dash's masternode network. This is a second tier masternode network that enables a lot of Dash's functions, such as instant transactions, private transactions, and scalability. And we have speed with instant send, which enable instant transactions and instantly respendable transactions, which have been embraced by exchanges around the world. The biggest one is Coinbase. Coinbase views Dash as being the most secure blockchain out there, only requiring two confirmations for a deposit. And there's other exchanges out there that require no confirmations. As soon as you send the Dash to the exchange, it's going to be, it's going to be accepted. So that's speed. Security we also have when it comes to uh, chain reorganizations and blockchains. That's not a thing that can happen with Dash because we have chain locks, which is a quorum of master nodes that say that this block is going to be the only block that's going to be accepted and that no other block can be accepted. So anybody who has 51% mining pool or mining uh, hash rate that tries to change those blocks, it's not going to happen. So what's the use of all that functionality if it's not easy to use? And that's why Dash is developing the Dash platform right now, which is going to make uh, cryptocurrency as easy to use as PayPal or Venmo. You can access your account from any system and, or any, any device that you want to access your uh, funds from. And uh, you can, the interface is going to be as easy to use as PayPal. So this is something that's important. Behind the scenes is great, but you want to have a good front end as well. And that's where Dash is going to shine also. So in this next clip, we find that Kim isn't buying the Bitcoin maximalist sales pitch. It's nice to be a store of value. But if you really want to succeed in this, in this game, you need to be the electronic cash. Kim realizes, as Bitcoin Cash and Dash have, that the public is going to value speedy instant transactions for low fees. And now let me tell you something else. Let me tell you why I think that. Right now, only 2% of internet users have even been exposed to crypto. We are a niche, small piece of shit in the universe of business, all right? But this is going to change. A lot of new people are going to come into the space. We talked about the growth numbers that you are expecting each year. You think that 16% of the internet population are going to use crypto in the next five years, right? Easily. Yeah. Easily. So where are all these people going? They don't know anything about the current wars that are taking place, the current toxicity within the crypto community, they are going to go with the currency that gives them the cheapest fees, the fastest transactions, the most reliability, and currently, unfortunately, that is not Bitcoin. No, it's definitely not. Kim has suspected that Bitcoin Cash might be his best choice for an online partnership as a cryptocurrency with his digital ventures. But I suspect that Kim is already in love with Dash. He just doesn't know it yet. Well, that's it for me today. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe and click the bell if you want to see more from me in Cash Alternative TV episodes. Until next time, remember, Dash is a better money for a better future. And that future is getting closer every day. Bye for now.